Hi! Let's look at the different types of fires and how to put them out in case of an accident in today's video. Fires are categorized according to the burning type of fuel. You could make things worse if you are using the wrong type of fire extinguisher on the wrong kind of fire. The six different fire classification is very important to understand. Class A, solids. Solid fuel fires are classified as Class A fires. Paper and cardboard, which are commonly used in offices and industries, could be used as a production of fuel. Furniture or fixtures and fittings could be involved. It could even be the building structure. Because solids are the most prevalent sort of fuel, this is one of the most common types of fire. Good housekeeping should aid in the reduction of materials such as packaging and garbage, hence reducing risks. A water extinguisher is the only form of fire extinguisher that should be used on a Class A fire. This is the most used type of extinguisher since it can put out most solid fuel fires. It should not, however, be used near electrical equipment because it is a conductor. Class B, Liquid Liquid fires are classified as Class B fires. Many fluids, liquids, and chemicals used in the workplace have the potential to be flammable or explosive. Cleaning fluids, solvents, fuels, inks, adhesives, and paints are just a few examples. These flames are rare, yet they are more dangerous than other types of fire. This type of fire should never be put out with a steady spray of water because it can scatter the fuel, spreading the flames. Extinguishing a liquid fire by blocking the fire's chemical chain reaction, as done by dry chemical and halon extinguishing chemicals, is the most efficient method. However smothering with CO2 or, for liquids, foam is also useful. Class C Gases Gaseous flames are classified as Class C fires. It might be natural gas, LPG, or other gases that create a flammable or explosive environment. Working with gas is hazardous and raises the chance of a fire. Keep stored gases in sealed containers in a secure storage facility, and make sure gas work is done by qualified individuals. While extinguishers can be used to put out Class C gas fires, the only safe way to do so is to turn off the gas supply. A dry powder extinguisher is the best type of extinguisher for putting out a fire when the gas supply is shut off. Class D Metal. Metals are not commonly thought of as flammable materials, however some metals, such as sodium, may be. Metals are also strong conductors, which aid in the propagation of a fire. At high temperatures, all metals weaken and melt, which may be a major issue when metal joists and columns are used as structural parts in a fire. How would you handle a Class D fire? Water may really function as an accelerant in metal flames, so how would you handle one? Metal fires can be put out with dry powder extinguishers. Depending on the type of metal danger it is meant for, the powder within the extinguisher may differ. Dry dirt or sand can be used to suppress small metal fires. Electrical fire Electrical fires are defined as fires that include potentially electrified electrical equipment. Short-circuiting machinery or overloaded electrical wires can create this type of fire. These flames can pose a serious risk to firemen who use water or other conductive agents, as electricity can be carried from the fire, through water, to the firefighter's body, and ultimately to the ground. Making certain that electrical equipment and systems are properly installed, inspected, and maintained will assist to decrease the danger of this sort of fire. While water should not be used to extinguish an electrical fire, other forms of fire extinguishers such as carbon dioxide and dry powder can be used in low voltage circumstances. If possible, always switch off the power supply. Class F, Cooking Fats and Oils Deep fat frying and spilt flammable oils near heat sources in kitchens can cause a Class F fire. Never leave food or cooking equipment alone while it is being used. Wet chemical extinguishers are the only form of fire extinguisher that may be used on frying oils and fats. A fire blanket might potentially be used to put out minor Class F fires. Hope you like this video. If you have any questions or comments, drop it in comment box. For more such videos, 
Subscribe to Marin Aura.